We'll give this mic a second to level out, and then we'll say, Welcome to Tibbles Apprentice. This is Big Green. This was uh, from Hello Good Game. Uh, so here it is. It's green, and you fight stuff occasionally. We'll see if I get this right. You want uh, creatures on the board as quick as you can. And uh, you have hexproof for one. That's well worth it. You could even buff things up just a little bit. So, um, extra mana, that's always good. And if we can get that vigor on the battlefield, we can start putting some... Wow. Well, this was going to be two out of three games. Let's see how this next one goes. Barely had time to explain what was going on. Small creatures on the board. Other creatures that can get counters and then pass them on to other creatures after they die. If they die. I was, uh, you know, provided you get a chance to put that actually on there. All right, let's do this. Let's swing in for another two points. All right, so we have enchantment removal. We have artifact removal. And I have the phone ringing. Great. All right, let's see if we can pick up Steam again. A quick tip, if people call you and you don't want them, their solicitors or whatever, just tell them they're on a recorded line and tell them to go ahead and go. And uh, they'll usually hang up or shut the heck up. All right, so I'm playing things off the top of the library at this point. I can get more mana on the field. Uh, I was just mentioning that I could have artifact and enchantment removal if I can cast another creature now. Um, this, uh, this deck I'm up against is definitely going to go wide against me, though. So, how do I keep up with that? All right, I could do this. I could fight something. I could put another creature on the battlefield. Um, creature on the battlefield will get me to destroy an artifact. Um, I think let's just cast a creature. We'll get some more mana. Let's uh, poke around, see which one of these is an artifact. Uh, yeah, or an enchantment. Let's get rid of that. Now, I think I'm going to hold back. I, I have a feeling something worse is coming. I am playing standard, which is not my forte. MTG Hillbilly could tell you that. Um, all right, so they are going to buff up the creature. Uh, oh, and they're going to make more creatures on their end stepped. Uh, 19 life. That's fine. I can do that. We're going to take out another... We'll take out another artifact. Uh, actually, we'll take out the enchantment. Let's get rid of the creature instead. We got that. Now we're going to get some land. And uh, we can still play cards off the top of our deck. I think, even though... Oh, man, they are going wider. Even wider than that. All right. Fine. Fair enough. Their creatures are growing at an exponential rate. Mine are not. If I get that vigor, I could do something about that. But we're at 19 life, nothing to worry about. Let's always play off the top of our deck. And with this, we are going to start popping some artifacts. All right, and they still get to get more stuff. All right, that is not good. It's not good for me. How am I going to win this? Leave that in the comments below. If you can figure out how I win this match, you could leave it there. Put your predictions there right now. Uh, they are just doing stuff. I'm doing stuff too, though. Uh, all right, so let's fight something. Uh, let's get, oh, so we get the ammo of vigor. Okay, so that goes in an interesting order. You get to cast the spell, you get to look at the cards, you get to uh, potentially put something on the board. And with the vigor, we can trigger this again. Actually, let's get rid of that enchantment. And uh, let's, let's make this big and have that fight. All right, they're still getting counters on stuff. All right, there has to be a way out of this. Do you see it on board already? Let's see. They won't commit to an attack. They've got plenty of one ones to pass around. I think they're just going to try to outbuff us. Play it off the top. Um, that is not good, so let's just give it to them. See what they do. Really waiting for direct damage. Or, uh, they're not going to go for that, though. They're going to go as wide as they can. That is massive. That is getting quite large. 
Yeah, that's what she said. Uh, so anyhow, sorry about that. Uh, where do we go from here? Man, they are just growing their army so wide. All right. This is not a legendary. So we could actually have multiple of those on the board at the same time. All right. So now we get some shenanigans going. Let's put some land down. Uh, let's read what that does. Okay. We're going to flip. Let's get rid of that. Flip that. Bring this back. All right. Choose two. Let's get tokens and let's destroy. Nope. They have to be cast. So it's not going to work quite the way I thought it was. That's probably going to cost me the game. Actually, I win this. How do I win it, though? Uh, let's choose these creatures. I didn't even realize that it did that. We'll distribute all those counters. Could have put them on one thing, but let's... Yeah, let's just get as many triggers as we possibly can. And there we go. That's pretty sweet. Uh, I can set back. I'm at 22 life. They're at 14. I could swing with everything, but I won't. Now, third stage, that's going to flip back, isn't it? I really think they really needed to rush into me. Oh, they are going the direct damage route. They just didn't pick off any of my creatures early. Uh, fair enough. All right. And, man, that is freaking massive. I can block and make my thing indestructible. And they just add another one. All right. So... This one flips back, trigger, grab two, play this off the top, play it for the vigor cost. All right, and uh, let's let's get some triggers going. So with that, put some counters on there. Uh, let's do this, and yeah, <laughs> not uh, not legendary. So we just go to town. And uh, let's start picking off those artifacts. One, two, that's good. And uh, sure, why not do this? Uh, I'm just gonna go with this first one. And <laughs> uh, it's not the card Overwhelming Splendor, but that's obviously what uh, caused them to bail out. All right, is that two out of three? Actually, that one was a draw, so that's really not worth putting up. This is a fine deck if you know what you're doing. There are lots of triggers. I could not play this in person. I am just not big brain enough. So, since and that has uh oh, that's a problem. Uh, since Arena keeps track of all your triggers, it's okay. It has taken me a while to get this deck to work though. When it goes off, when it pops off, it absolutely does. In there. Let's go ahead. Take some damage to their face. Um, another one. Another tough cookie. All right. That will probably be the undoing. Have I missed a land drop? No. We're still on target. Take a little bit of damage. That's okay. I can shake it off. Uh, should I be fighting anything? Uh, that's something I can cast. Go ahead and cast it. Actually, that's not... Uh, yeah, let's get rid of this. Maybe not the most effective play, but I'm going to swing in just to let them know that they can't push me around. And uh, where are we going from here? Another and... Oh, that's... That was rude. Um, I think I'm going to wind up upside down at this point. Put the Vigor on the board. Should be able to get some counters on it. I'll be alright. Uh, will I be alright? Mm, that's not looking good. That does not look good. Oh, and they become unblockable. Yeah, that's... That's going to be a problem. Alright, I can draw into something. This deck has potential. This, however, is legendary. So let's do this. Use the vigor. I will 
keep this one. Got to remember to select the right one. Keep the one that has the counter on it. Um, yikes, I am down to nine life. This probably, yeah, there is, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and block you. Oh, crap. Yeah, well, let's play out the motions anyhow. We're going to give it indestructible, pump it up as big as we can, and it um, doesn't matter because we are not going to see another turn. Anyhow, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. Remember, if you shop for cards, shop local, LGS. If not, Dark Ritual on TCG Player to help support the channel. Easy way to do it, and you get the cards you want. Thanks for watching.